안녕하세요, 사모님. What happens when the movie you're watching turns into something completely different? Just when you had a grasp of the characters, the plot, and themes, <laughs> the floor falls out from underneath you. <laughs> a fantastic example of this can be found in Bong Joon-ho's immaculately constructed Parasite. This is more than just a plot twist. The entire look and feel of the film is upended. Watch how the tone shifts between comedy and menacing thriller. Before we crawl in, subscribe and ring the bell to get a steady digest of filmmaking technique videos like this. Parasite is all about power. Those who have it, like the Park family, and those who don't, like the Kims. The Kim family has conned their way into becoming servants for the Parks. <laughs> In this first half of the film, the tone is generally light and charming. But then, Bong Joon-ho <gasps> manages to pull off a 180-degree change in tone and genre. Spoiler alert. We're about to reveal one of Parasite's biggest secrets. <laughs> Our first hint that something is wrong comes with the arrival of the ousted housekeeper, Moon Wang. Young Bunny was... <laughs> Once clean and proper, <laughs> Moon's presence is immediately unnerving. She's soaked in rain, her face swollen, the grainy monitor, the unflattering angle. All of these imbue her with a creepy, unsettling appearance. And it's our first clue that there is more to this character than previously assumed. <laughs> the script describes her current appearance as grotesque, with one eye heavily swollen. Immediately, the director shifts the tone. We punch in tighter to emphasize her manic expression as the script describes this moment. Moon Wang flashes a creepy grin as she points to the stairs descending into the dark storage basement. <laughs> It now feels like a suspense thriller. Where is this going? Pushing us further into thriller territory is the very next shot. Somebody doesn't want anyone to see what's about to happen. We were confused before, but now this situation feels dangerous. As Chung Suk follows Moon into the basement, we see this. It's an absurd visual, as humorous as it is unnerving. The genre has shifted back. It's a comedy again. Oh, <laughs> 
But the biggest reveal is yet to come. <laughs> Panicked, we follow Chung Sook into the unknown depths. The character, camera, and audience are all caught off guard and are left needing to catch up. <laughs> And what does Chang Su find in the basement? Is it as horrifying as the last few moments? Not quite. We're back to surrealist comedy. The creepy husband, the milk bottle, the pliers, the banana. These elements point directly to absurdist comedy. But the look and feel of this basement, with its sickly green lighting, point to something else entirely, creating a unique viewing experience, that of uncertainty and curiosity. The gags and comedic tone of the first half are eventually replaced with high-stakes power shifts <laughs> and horrific violence. These are the unsettling dualities of Parasite. A delicate and metaphorical tightrope that the director walks throughout the entirety of the film. How did you feel about Parasite's midpoint shift? Did we miss anything? Tell us in the comments. Feel free to take a page from Bong Joon-ho's playbook when planning your sequences. Just be sure to return it before he notices. Remember to subscribe and click the bell to stay in the loop with more filmmaking techniques. We'll see you in the next one.